this video is all about shape manipulation. So, when I click on an object here, and notice how I can click on it, or I can make a little box around it, and it will highlight itself. When it's highlighted, you're going to notice a couple of special things. You're going to notice three different types of symbols. This arrow, these kind of arrows here, the arrows do rotation, so I left click and drag rotations around. You can see it does it by degrees. The farther away I drag, click and drag, is the more control I have over this rotation. If I do it close, it's kind of hard to control. All right. The second thing we have are these little white boxes. Now the white boxes let us resize. So if I left click and drag, notice I can make this shape bigger or smaller. If I rotate it, I can also make it taller, things like that. So that's what those little white boxes do all over this object. And the last symbol is a little black cone that you're seeing right there. If I click and drag that up or down, it raises or lowers our piece. So you also notice when I click on this, and I maybe sometimes even click the white little box, it highlights and has numbers. You can change the numbers instead of click and drag, a more precise uh, design. So if I click it, I can maybe change it to 20. And I can hit, you know, I can click it again and maybe change it to 40. This is for more precise design. Those are the dimensions on the side of the call. So three symbols and dimensions, and you'll be able to pretty much manipulate this shape however you want to manipulate it.